Hi, Ray Hayden here, and this video is gonna be part of the Creators Helping Creators series that I'm making, and this one here is gonna go back to YouTube Studio Beta, and in this one here, I'm gonna talk about the Reach Viewers tab. Now, I'm gonna go to this impressions click-through rate because I wanna open up that little help box over here on the side. We'll come over to that in a minute. The first thing I'm gonna talk about is impressions rate. This is probably the most important number we can have in all of YouTube. This is how many times people are even seeing a thumbnail on YouTube. Anywhere else, it doesn't matter. It's, these are the number of times YouTube served up one of our thumbnails. They're helping us out, right? Help me to help you. YouTube is helping us out by presenting one of our thumbnails to a viewer, all right? It may not be on one of our own videos. It might be those videos at the end, you know, all those little videos pop up. That might be where they're seeing it. It might be on the side of the screen, uh, on the far right, it might be above, below, or somewhere else on the screen, whichever you know format they're looking at, but they're seeing one of our thumbnails. 89.6 thousand times in the last 28 days here from November 11th to December 8th, 2018. In this 28 day period, 89.6 thousand impressions of my thumbnails had been seen by, uh, or could have been seen, whether or not they looked at it, by uh, potential viewers, right? By people who are actually viewing videos on YouTube. 4.1% of those folks clicked on the icon on the um, thumbnail and came and watched one of my videos. To some extent, maybe they only watched it for a few seconds, maybe they watched the whole thing, hopefully closer to the whole thing, right? Or at least 51% or more, right? That's what I'm looking for as a minimum. Uh, 7.8 thousand views and 4,000 unique viewers. 7.8 thousand is almost twice as much as 4,000. That means that people are watching my video on average more than one video per person. If we look at build an audience, it'll tell us. 1.9 videos per viewer, all right? So crystal clear, right? So almost twice as many people, uh, almost twice as many views as there are unique viewers. However, unique viewers is also important because I have 1.7 thousand subscribers, 4,000 is more. That means that um, more than 2,000 of these people, or like you know, 2,300 of these people are my potential customer base. I wanna know how many people I can reach on YouTube. Here's the number right here. The number of unique viewers in any particular period that's the number of people that you have as your unique audience. Now, I wanna show you something here. This only goes back 90 days. So in the last 90 days, there's 12.000 unique viewers, all right? So that would be over 90 days, that would be my unique viewer. There's 297,000 impressions, 4.1% click-through rate, <laughs> oddly enough, uh, 25,000 views and 12,000 unique viewers. That's my 90 day potential customer base. Now, a lot of these people might never come back to any of my videos again. In the last 28 days, this is my current audience, right? So in the last 28 days, 4,000 unique viewers came by. These are the people I have to reach out to and somehow um, impress them enough to want, you know, for them to want to uh, subscribe to the channel. That's what we need. We need subscribers to move up the food chain, shall we say. Uh, the impressions, again, being the number of times people have seen our thumbnails and the percentage rate of people who clicked on our thumbnails to come to our page. Let's go look at the help page. Let me get rid of this for a second. Under the impressions thing, there's this learn more. This go ahead, it opens up this help page on the side. I wanna look at this paragraph down here specifically. This says half of all channels and videos on YouTube have an impression CTR, that's click-through rate, that can range between two and 10%. So this is within that range. So, okay, I can feel fine about the click-through rate. And if half of all channels on YouTube have a two to 10% click-through rate, that's great, right? Well, maybe not. What's the impression rate? This is, you know, if I'm within the two to 10% here, this is a number I want to be a whole lot higher, right? So if I had 20 million impressions and an impression click-through rate of one or 2%, that's really not, or what, less than 2%, but it's more than 1%, I'm still gonna end up with a lot more views and probably a lot more unique viewers, right? So at this point, now that I know that I'm within the two to 10%, this percent, this number of impressions is more important to me. So I have to do everything I can do to make my thumbnails show up in front of more viewers, right? So this is what I'm really getting from this. I have a good number of unique viewers because it's greater than the number of subscribers I currently have. The number of unique viewers is lower than the number of views I have, which means People are watching my videos more than once. The percentage rate of impressions, the click-through rate is good because it's within a realm of two to 10%. So now I have to work on the number of impressions. I have to be able to get my videos out in front of more people to have that potential 
to acquire more of my audience from the unique viewers who may not already be subscribed, all right? I hope that's helpful. By all means, make comments below, ask questions. Creators helping creators, that's what it's all about. Help me to help you help each other, all right? And uh, with that, don't forget to give me a thumbs up on this video. Uh, if you haven't already, subscribe to the channel. Channel, Make your comments below. And um, until I catch you in the next video, take care and be well.